Yo, yo, peace, 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 peace. This is your brother King coming at y'all. Coming to talk about some of the real good topics. Do me a favor. I want you to like this. I want you to comment below. And I also want you to subscribe. I need your subscriptions so we can broadcast all of our messages out to the world. But this video is about Justin Bieber. I'm about to tell y'all something secret about Justin Bieber too as well. That y'all pretty, 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 pretty much don't know. So... Stay tuned for after I do this. It's going, I'm going to tell you all the things you need to know about Justin. But getting into what he's doing right now. Yo, Justin. Justin. My man. Yo, Justin Bieber. He's bigger than Elvis Presley. And I know y'all love. I know y'all grandmothers and grand, grandfathers and great-great-grandmothers love. There's some Elvis Presley. But this brother right here has gone through a complete transformation. And not really his lyrics. We went to walk over the lyrics with y'all right now in his new song, Intentions. By the way, it's a dope banger. It's a great song. Go check it out, especially the video. Go check, go check out the video. But more than that, man, Justin Bieber, yo. Yo, yo, this man, he got, <laughs> I, I love to see when artists make a transformation. I love to see how artists can grow when you have a big machine, like a, like a music industry exec go through, you first get the child, he's, he's dinky, he can, he has a little bit of talent, they can sing or whatnot, but you don't know who you really got. You know what I'm saying? Later on in that person's career, they could be doing dope. They could be doing drugs. They could be doing all kinds of stuff. But they still have a talent. They could be a womanizer, like my man Chris B, apparently, you know, um, or allegedly. But you never know. But when you look at Justin Bieber, what he's doing with his celebrityism, he's doing some great things, man. This new video, uh, Intentions. It's speaking about his intentions of what he's doing for the world. In his video, he went to like a homeless shelter down, down town Skid Row. And that downtown Skid Row is, is crazy. I actually have a documentary I'm going to post below the comment. I want you to go check out that documentary about not just about Skid Row, but it's about the homelessness in Los Angeles and, you know, where it's stemming from, some of the capable of things you know i've done my own investigation i'm in also i've, I've you know I've, I've lived here in la and i know about what's going on somewhat and then someone i don't you know what i mean uh, uh, other things got to be filled in nobody knows the whole complete story but there is a story downtown los angeles where people are living uh you know it's like zombie land you know but him and quavo went to downtown skid row uh, to this um, to this outreach community that's there. This one sister, she does um, uh, poetry, and she she's highlighted in the video. But also, who's highlighted in the video is uh, Quavo. Quavo's there, and and Justin. They're actually there, uh, attempting to in the video, attempting to just give a hand to some of the people, you know, and let them know. She actually takes one. Once it, one uh, lady or a black lady that has been uh, uh, struggling because her situation is at home. She hasn't, she didn't have like uh, her full financial support from her mom because her mom was going through issues. She's just been going through a lot. And then Justin Bieber pops up and is like, hey, what if I can help you out with a car? And she, and the lady just starts to break down like, oh my God. Are you serious? Like, she really starts to cry right there on the video. And I said to myself, I was like, man, this is amazing. It's amazing to see artists not just give back to people, but really be about a mission. Really searching out people that they can help. Because sometimes people that are in or that, that are looking for help, they, they result to crime, taking and stealing. Not because they want to, not because they're bad people, but because they're put in the position of um, of uh, survival. And when you put human beings in position of survival, they're going to do whatever they need to do. 
that's one of the reasons you need to educate them properly. You know, have them a proper education, and not uh, uh, education that's based on uh, that's based on status instead of um, actual principles in the job force. You know, actual certificates in the job force, being able to strengthen the job force in America. So, when you don't have that in in, in Los Angeles, there there isn't that. And then there's discrimination at all different levels. You got color discrimination. You have, um, you also have uh, uh, people that are out there discriminating against sex, against race, uh, 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 against all the isms, I like to call them. That's here in LA. So we have a huge problem here in LA about homelessness. But Justin Bieber in his new song, he, he highlights it and goes out to be an outreach. And I think that's amazingly beautiful. So, Justin, peace to you. Peace to Quavo. I'm glad you jumped on it. I'm about to go over some of their lyrics so you can just hear it or just he hear the words of it. So, here's some of it right now, all right? He says in the chorus, picture perfect. You don't need no filter. Gorgeous. Make them drop dead. You a killer. Shower you with all my intentions. Yeah, these are my only intentions. Stay in the kitchen cooking. You got your own bread. Heart filled of e equity. You're an asset. Make sure that you don't need no mention. Yeah, these are my only intentions. So, again, the the lyrics are, are kind of watered down. But the video, if you could see the video, for those that are hearing impaired, or, or sight impaired, you can't see the video. But if y'all could see the video, he's actually giving back. And it's so beautiful. He's actually helping people out there. You know what I mean? So that's a beautiful thing. Here's another part of the verse. It says, shout out to your mom and, and, and dad for making you stand. They did a great job raising you when I created you're my muse, the kind of smile that makes the news. Can't nobody throw shade on your name in these streets. Triple threat, you a boss, you a babe, you a beast. You make it easy to choose. You got a main touch, I can't refuse. No, I can't refuse. Then it goes back into the coach, the, the chorus again, picture perfect. Uh, and here, let me jump down to Quavo's verse. Uh, Quavo's verse is this, here it is right here. No cap, no pretending. You don't need mention. Got them some goals. They don't want to be independent. Tell them to mind their business. We in our feelings. It's 50 50 percent attention. We need commitment. We gotta both admit it. It's funny we both listening. It's a blessing because we both in it. You the best thing. I don't need a witness. I'm going to find a ring and pray. It's a perfect fit. So, again, the, even this verse is a, is a different verse for Quavo where he's getting in there and he's saying he's trying to be committed. Hey, it's going to be 50-50 in the a, in a, in a relationship. You know, he he's probably at a different different stage. It's like where he's trying to look to settle down. You know, when you go out there through your entire celebrity and you see the world in the different eyes, we got millions of people coming after you. Which again is it's not natural, but they go through it, and I think that's the reason why they go through a lot of loneliness is being an artist because you can't hardly can't trust anyone because everybody knows your actual name, everybody knows your business, you ain't got no business. It's like the world is like one big, one big small pot. That's why a lot of artists need um, psychiatrists or therapists when they go on the road to try to pull them out, man, because they, because that most definitely will will um, lead to a lot of uh, psychosis. It'll lead to a lot of stuff. That's why a lot of artists go do dope, too. It's not because it's just there, but it's just because it's just a part of the, it's just a part of the life, you know? So, hey, man, I want y'all to understand. I want y'all to know. I want you to be at peace. Thank you for taking the time. I want you to subscribe. Also, the secret that y'all don't know about Justin Bieber. Hey, when y'all go to his next concert, you're going to be able to see the great, wonderful things that he's doing. 
So I want you to believe in him. I want you to see him. He's starting to own a lot of things out there in the public that are going to be amazing. So do me a favor. Do me a favor. Take time. Go get that single with Justin Bieber and Quavo. And um, do your thing. All right? That was the secret. Also, comment, like, and s subscribe down below. I love to love y'all. This is King signing out. Go listen to that song. Peace.